All right, about to do some uh, Halloween farming. Um, I looked at this, the uh, R19 Halloween place, and it actually looks to be pretty good for farming. Um, I apologize for all the wind going on. We got another hurricane hitting us tonight. Uh, hurricane Zeta. So this is like the fifth one. It seems like every couple of weeks I'm, I'm recording during a hurricane. But whatever. All right. What's going on? What's going in there? Now this is R19, and I don't know how good 23,000 magic finds going to be here. I probably need to be like at 30, but I'm running two dev blows just to kind of speed things up, I guess. I don't know. We'll see how it goes. All right. Let's see. Wee! Come on, guys. And I kind of do need some essence to uh, finish filling out my uh, vitality on the last ring so I can um, use it in my dev blow build. That way uh, I can have as much life as possible when I'm running those upper uh, multiplayer R's. The 30s and 40s if I could ever get multiplayer to work and for everybody who who can't play this right now I, I really feel for you it's kind of strange that they would release this type of event and I've said it before in some of my comments um, for only a certain amount of people I don't really get that but it seems solid as in like very very stable so maybe they will release this uh to the public and not just beta users I, I i don't really get that move maybe they just wanted us to test it out and everything but i mean you don't really get a great reward from doing this it's a stupid pumpkin head but, I mean, it's it's something exclusive. And you know how people like exclusive content and stuff. And, you know, people are want to do an event. And this is just something new, so people want to do it. And uh, I, I just, I don't get that move. But maybe in the next couple of days, uh, they'll let it, they'll put it out in the public. I don't know. Maybe. We'll see. It would be cool. Because I, I get... I've been getting a lot of questions like, Where is this? Why, why am I not ha Well, I mean, honestly, because... You know, you're not in beta. And... It, it's not really fair for some people who... Either didn't know about beta, just started the game... You know, whatever. Like I said, it just seems kind of strange that they did this... Um, but maybe, hopefully, they'll change things. Uh, R19 drop rate is almost, seems to be just as shitty as R20. Because R20 drop rate is bad with 23k. It, it's, it's basically because everything, it, everything is being rolled is going to be T6. And T6 has that higher magic find requirement. And you just don't get as many drops. So. Oh, and uh, you can beat the boss as many times as you want to. But he does not give you anything different. I, uh, I went in and tried, to, and tried again and, and beat him. Just to see if he gave me something different. And he didn't. So. Seems like the only thing you can get is the good old pumpkin head. Ooh, look, I got a drop, and it's a Centurion, or an Aurelian, or an Anti-Magic Visage. Let's see what it is. Anti-Magic Visage. That's sad that I know what all these things are just by looking at them. Uh, I've played this game way too much. Way, way too much. 
Where's my essence sitting at? I'm only at 135. I think I need 175. Yeah. And the only kind of shitty thing about doing that, um, doing all the vitality is when you take out all that intelligence, it drops your magic resist. So I got to throw in more diamonds on my gear, but I think that's uh, a good trade off, honestly. Because health is kind of like a passive resistance, so to speak. Because it, it it's a resist against everything, if that makes sense. It just, you know, you get more life, so you can pretty much resist more stuff. And um, when you use a healing potion or something like that, since it does percentage, you'll be healed for more. Man, that wind's really picking up if y'all can hear it. I mean, I mean, how much of this shit have I killed and I've only gotten one drop? And it was a shitty anti-magic visage. Uh, let's see, let's get them gathered. That's what I like about my mage. I couldn't do this on my warrior or my goofy archer they would be dead my mage can just tank and blow shit up and it also helps that a lot of this is magic and because i have so much intelligence it um doesn't really affect me okay i've gotten three drops yeah see a lot of this is uh needed for mad is magic and I've got a shit ton of resist just with intellect. So. Have I even gotten a mystery bag yet? I've gotten one. I'm not going to use it. It'll probably drop me down to one life. Yeah, do not use those mystery bags while you are, like, in combat. <laughs> Wait till you get somewhere safe. Because... Inevitably, you'll, like, drop down to no life. And, uh... See? What did I tell you? Alright, I'm gonna do a little bit more and see what I can get. I thought this was gonna be a good farming spot, but apparently I was wrong. That's because R19. Bleh. I never really go above R... 17 every once in a while i'll play around in 18 it's just because the drops are so shitty i mean it, it just it it really really is a shitty drop rate for everything and it seems like i know that t6 has a higher requirement and but it just seems like i get more t6 drops in 15 16 and 17 yeah i get uh t5 drops but I get a lot of T6, and when I'm doing R20 and R19, I just, I, I don't get drops, and it just, it's, it's really not worth it. I, I just don't understand if it's because you go up in R's that the, uh, requirement is higher. I know that T6 does have a higher requirement, but I'm wondering if, if as you go up in R's, there's a higher requirement. It seems like there is. But that wouldn't, it just doesn't make a lot of sense to me. I don't know. A lot of things about this game don't make a lot of sense to me. I just say, whatever. Fuck it. Let's do it. Kind of like this right here. I wonder if I can actually survive this. Oh yeah, I'm good. And that's the other thing about higher R's, is almost constantly cursor. Cursor, weak R, uh, and slow. All the fucking time. It, it, it is just absurd. I'm always at half health. And we got those healers, that's always fun. Oh, hit a potion. Am I hitting stuff? I got a double 
Goddamn, what is that, bubble force field shit? This is proven to be very annoying. Alright, okay, I killed something. Let's see if I can kill more. Man, my health is dropping. Block missile, kill that block missile asshole. Alright, got him down. Now I can just fight. So there was a healer in there. There were two block missiles. I think there was a weak. Uh, some cursors. Yeah. And out of all of that, I got zero drops. Let's see what my. If I, now I didn't get any bags either. So, consensus is uh, this is really not worth the time. I mean, do it if you want to. I can't see this being a better place to farm than 15 and 16 keys or uh, Blacklands or MT5. But that's up to you. If you want to do it, go have fun. Y'all have a good one.